This is a story of graceful acceptance. This is Ayat's story with three supporting characters. Her father, Asif. Her father figure, Shiraz. And I, Uruj, her mother. Asif is the best father for Ayat in this whole wide world. In his own words, having Ayat in his life is his biggest accomplishment. Ungli pakad ke tune Chalna sikhaya tha na Dehli zoochi hai ye paar kara de Shiraz has accepted and acknowledged Ayat as a part of my being. You gave me wings and made me fly You touched my head, I could touch the sky He recognizes that Ayat is my priority while Ayat has very gracefully accepted Shiraz as her father figure, giving him space in her heart while still keeping her father at the highest pedestal. I'm nothing but an observer of this miracle unfolding in our lives. These two men have challenged all conventional wisdoms, while Ayat has proven to be wise beyond her years. She has lived up to her name. She is a revelation to us all. She is like any ordinary nine-year-old, but what makes her extraordinary is the way she acknowledged the fact that her biological parents are not going to live together but can still be relevant, present, available and important in her life. All the supporting characters in this story have put their own interest aside when it comes to Ayat. She remains the focal point of our love. We can choose to live our life with or without someone. But when it comes to our children, we are together because children come 